All right, let's talk a bit about Nucor. It's a steelmaker, of course, and the stock is moving lower this following a new profit forecast. Seema Modi has the story for us. Seema. David Nucor is slashing its second quarter guidance. It's about 26 percent below analyst consensus. Its steel business is expected to see a sequential decline due to lower selling prices, weak volume. Pricing power has been a concern in the market, and it's one of the reasons the stock has underperformed. It comes just days after Nucor announced its acquisition of Ritech, a manufacturer of high-performance commercial doors for buildings for about $565 million. And it also follows the release of Wolf's Steel Survey, David, which you mentioned last hour, that showed the most cautious demand in three years. When asked about inventory plans into the third quarter, just 12 percent of buyers planning to restock down from the prior survey's 21 percent. Analysts citing weaker economy, excess capacity from China, plus that ISM report last week that confirmed the U.S. manufacturing sector contracted in May for the second consecutive month. You'll see this coincides with that steep drop in steel prices this year. Other names in the steel space, ArcelorMittal, U.S. Steel, are down not just today, but sharply this year. In the industrial space, MSC, a mid-cap equipment distributor that sells to larger construction players, released a profit warning citing weakness in the heavy manufacturing sector. You'll see names like Fastenal, Caterpillar are down today, Sarah.